Hey, I am Luis Villalobos. Welcome for the first day stay for in the tour of the Utah. So thank you so much. Today was a pretty brutal fourth stage to the Tour Utah. Um, we started out on Antelope Island and raced through all kinds of herds of uh, buffalo and stuff. So yeah, that was sweet. And um, yeah, the rest of the stage was really hot and windy and it took, took I think almost an hour and a half for the break to go. Um, just attack after attack after attack after attack. Um, so yeah, it was, <laughs> everyone was really, hoping for the break to go, but it just seemed like every team wanted to be in it. And yeah, when when every team wasn't in it, guys would chase it down and then the whole group would just keep doing the same thing over and over and again. But um, yeah, eventually uh, Gage got in the break. Um, and so yeah, everything calmed down for a little bit, but Lotto, Lotto didn't want the gap to get too big because we'd already been racing for 45 miles. Um, so they went right to the front, right in tempo. Um, meanwhile, the, the rest of the team, um, we were sort of watching over Hernandez today and making sure that he had the best setup for the sprint at the end of the stage. So it was, it was all about just getting bottles and ice and, uh, yeah, trying to keep everyone hydrated and cool. And yeah, and then as it came down, to probably like 30 or 40 K to go. Um, the break was like in a minute and a half. They never really got over two and a half minutes, I think was the biggest gap. Um, so everyone sort of knew that the break was coming back. And then once we got into Layton, um, that we did like five laps on a four or five K circuit, something like that. And uh, Hernandez with three laps to go had a uh, slight chain drop slash other mechanical problems and uh so he actually had to get a bike change with like maybe 15k to go on a ripping fast circuit so that uh that threw a wrench in our plans but we were able to get him back up and uh yeah move through the field with probably a lap and a half to go we were back in position and then uh yeah came down to the sprint everyone was fighting and uh Unfortunately, I think Hernandez didn't ha quite have the ride he was hoping for and came around in the sprint and just didn't quite have it. Um, but I mean, all in all, I think the team rode really well and especially coming off of Luis's result yesterday and having him sitting in 12th GC, we were like really motivated and felt, felt comfor comfortable and uh, confident in the field for sure. And just, yeah, we're, we're having fun racing bikes, so. Yeah, it was good.